Hey guys, in this tutorial I'll be showing you how to record your iPhone screen. This will only work with iOS 7 and iOS 8. So the iRecording app is actually recording the screen and the microphone at the same time. So it's recording my voice right now and I'm going to tell you how to get it. So first what you want to do is, let me delete the app first. First what you want to do is go to Safari and go to your search bar and type in emu4ios.net and click go and you're going to scroll down and click the install. So click on it and a message should pop up saying that I'm um, asking you if you want to install it. Click install. Go to your home and it's going to start downloading onto your iPhone or iPod or iPad, doesn't matter. So we're going to wait for that to download and I'll get back to you guys. Okay, after the app is done downloading onto your iPhone, iPad or iPod, it's going to start installing. So during the installation, this is very important, what you want to do is change the date to 2012 so go to settings go to general date and time and if you can't click on the date to change it make sure you the set automatically is unchecked click on September um, the date and then go back to 2012 And it doesn't matter what month it is, you just need to go back to 2012. Okay, and just click the home key. And it's going to start installing onto your iPhone, iPod, or iPad, doesn't matter. And it, it's going to work this time. Okay, so it's going to be done installing now what you want to do is click on the emulator for iOS and don't change the date yet and it's going to close like that and now go to settings change the date back to 2014 or whenever um, whatever year you're watching this video from and put it back to your um, current date and month. Click the home key uh, and double click your home key thingy and close the emulator. Go back to your home screen, click on it again and this is going to show up and the first one is the screen recorder. Click on it. I, I already have it installed and what you want to do is just click install and once and you don't have to change the date and once it's done installing onto your home screen click on it and if it closes on you go back change the date to 2012 click on the app again and once it's working you can go back and change it to your current year and after that, it'll be working normally. So that's it, guys. That's how you um, record your iPhone screen or whatever screen you have. And so the fe some features are um, you can um, retype the name right there. And it saves it to the recording. And you can actually uh, you can swipe to the left to delete it. And if you click the I icon, you can export it to your camera roll. So thanks for watching. Don't forget to rate, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see you next time.